Ever wondered what makes a charismatic person leave a lasting impression? It's an intriguing question, isn't it? The aura they exude, the magnetism that pulls you in, the unspoken charm that leaves you hanging on to their every word. How do they do it? What's their secret? Let's dig a little deeper. It's not just the words they say, it's far more complex and nuanced than that. Their charm is the result of an intricate balance of many factors, a delicate mix of different elements that work together to create a unique persona that stands out in any crowd. Let's start from the moment they enter a room, the way they carry themselves, their stride, their posture, their level-headedness amidst any situation. It's all a part of their charisma. They exude an air of confidence that is neither arrogant nor overbearing and inviting. It's as if they have a spotlight on them, captivating everyone's attention without saying a word. Then there's the way they dress. It's not about brand names or latest fashion trends, but rather an expression of their individuality. The way they wear their clothes, the way they style their hair, the small accessories they sport, every detail adds to their charm, making them undeniably attractive. And let's not forget the gestures they use while speaking, the way they use their hands to emphasize their point, the way their eyes light up when they talk about something they're passionate about, the way they lean in when they're deeply engaged in a conversation. These are the small things that make a big difference. It's these gestures that make their words come alive, that give depth to their speech, that make people sit up and listen. It's not just about how they speak, but also about what they say. Their choice of words, their tone, their pacing, everything contributes to their charisma. They're not just saying words, they're telling a story, they're painting a picture, they're transporting you to a different world. And it's this ability to captivate their audience, to engage them in a meaningful way, that sets them apart. In addition, there's their emotional intelligence, their ability to read the room, to understand people's emotions, to empathize with others, to know when to talk and when to listen. This is not something that can be learned from a book, but it's something that comes with experience, with time, with maturity. Then there's their authenticity. There's no no facade, no attempt to be someone they're not. They're genuine, they're real, they're true to themselves. And it's this authenticity that makes them relatable, that makes them trustworthy, that makes people want to be around them. Lastly, there's their positive energy. They radiate positivity. They inspire others. They lift people up. They see the best in people. They see the potential in every situation. They see the beauty in the world. And it's this optimism, this positivity, this zest for life that makes them truly charismatic. These subtle elements can make a world of difference in the way people perceive them. It's no wonder charismatic people leave a lasting impression. Their charm, their warmth, their genuineness, their positivity, it's all a part of the mesmerizing enigma that is charisma. So next time you meet a charismatic person, keep these points in mind and maybe, just maybe, you'll see what makes them so special. Take Simu Liu, an emerging A-list celebrity for instance. His charismatic demeanor and the way he presents himself have left an extraordinary first impression on many. So what can we learn from Simu to improve our first impressions? There are six common mistakes people often make during their first impressions and six habits we can learn from Simu to make a remarkable first impression. The beauty of these habits is that they are relatively simple to adopt. It's just that most people aren't aware of them. Firstly, many people assume that the first impression starts when they begin speaking, but actually, it begins the moment someone notices you. That's why making an entrance is so important. This doesn't mean you have to dance your way into every room, but rather adopt confident body language and radiate positive energy. Even something as simple as walking in with your head held high, shoulders back, and a smile on your face can make a difference. Another tip is to be comfortable with the space around you. A common mistake people make is keeping their arms tight to their body while speaking. This can give off an impression of lack of confidence. Instead, having your arms move freely can subconsciously influence how people perceive you. Moreover, once social gatherings become common again, leading with some form of touch, such as a handshake or a hug, can help establish an instant connection. What you say also matters. One effective habit is to look for observational compliments early in the interaction. This doesn't mean forcing a compliment, but rather, if there's something you genuinely appreciate, don't hesitate to express it. 
To summarize, making a great first impression involves several key points, making a confident entrance, being comfortable with the space around you, establishing a physical connection where appropriate, and looking for genuine compliments to give. Adopting these habits can significantly improve the way people perceive you, leading to more positive interactions and leaving a lasting impression, just like Simu Lu.